To create threaded text means to link two or more text boxes together. So let's look at the setup that I have here. On the left hand side I've got one text box full of some dummy text and on the right hand side I've got just an empty text box. If I was to make the text box with my words in it much smaller, this is normally what happens. I get my little red cross at the very bottom right hand corner saying there's overset text. One thing I can do is to click on this little icon and this will give me a little preview of the text following my cursor. Now wherever I click, if I click into the empty text box, it will flow the text from this text box into this text box. So if I was to click and adjust the size of this, you can see that now it's flowing from one into the other and those two are linked. No matter where I place my text box or what size I created, these two texts are now connected with one another. If you want to see the connection between the two, you can go to View, down to Extras, and Show Text Threads. This will give you little arrows pointing from one column to the end or to the starting point of another column of text. Additionally, if you wanted to create other text boxes, so let's say I made this one much too small. You can see it's giving me the little arrow. I can click on the overset text, uh, text box at the very bottom. This gives me my little preview. I can then click and drag and create another text box and that will automatically flow the text into there. So now it's flowing from all three different text boxes. When I deselect them, notice that the text threads are gone. You only see the text thread arrows when you select one or more of the boxes.